YouTube fam, YouTube fam, what is going on? Yo, I am like, y'all just don't even understand like how happy I am right now. Like, life is great, <laughs> for real. Your girl soloed out in the own truck. Yes, Lord, just me, just me. <sighs> Finished my first load today. Everything going smooth, everything going smooth. Uh, I just wanted to give y'all a quick update on what to expect out here when you solo out. So, basically the rundown of it is, first thing you're going to do is go over everything with your trainer. Um, he's going to look through your blue book. Some of them look through them, some of them don't. Mine's did. Um, the, the trainer I had was pretty thorough. I went through like three trainers, y'all. If y'all are based out of Tennessee, and y'all go with May Truck and just know that it's going to be a little dysfunctional. Um, I've heard from a lot of people that the Tennessee Terminal is pretty disorganized. So, if y'all want to stick in there, they, they did pay me. I ain't have no issues with the payments. But as far as where was I supposed to be and how long train it was, it was pretty disorganized. Because my training overall was about a month and a half. Okay? So, I mean, I was still getting paid. But damn, you know what I'm saying? Like... But it is what it is. I got through it. I got through it in one number good practice. Um, the solo out test. So, once you finish your little blue book, which is the homework they're going to give you during orientation, um, they're going to send you to a terminal. 9 to 10 is either be your home terminal or the terminal that you're closest to at that time. And you can request to go to a certain te terminal to test out. Um, I recommend it, me personally, because I was originally going to solo out in um, in Oregon, which is their headquarters. And I was like, nah, I heard too many people say, like, don't don't go to the headquarters to test out. They they too strict. They too strict, which I could probably do it. But, you know, why make it hard on yourself when you don't have to? This thing has been going out for the longest, y'all. That's for the tires, low tire pressure. But anyways, yeah, um, don't go to the headquarters. Um, but one good terminal that I know has gotten a lot of good reviews is the terminal in Denver, Denver, Colorado. That's the one I tested out in. And they are, I, I can honestly say it was pretty, it was more like an educational thing than anything. Like, the stuff you get wrong, they're going to go over, let you practice it. And if you do too bad, they're going to put you back on the road with your trainer. And if you just do terrible, they're going to send your ass home. That's just the honest um, the honest thing of what they're going to do. It's just I can't sugarcoat it for y'all. But they not too strict. Like they gonna, It's pretty educational. They're going to run you through the stuff that you don't know. Um, the stuff that you do know, they're just going to give you a quick review over it, test you, make sure you got the basics down packed. It's pretty straightforward. It's, honestly, it was a lot easier than I thought. But knowing me, because I ain't never been solo before with trucking, so I was hyping it up in my head a lot. I know that much. But yeah, it all worked out for the best. It all worked out for the best. Um, from what I can tell with my first trip and from what I've heard, um, your first few trips, they just really trying to see how you run. Um basically what all you know what you still need to work on um if you're paying attention to their messages and stuff like that because they real they real big on the message especially since they don't have a gps like those messages for the directions and routing is super super important super important y'all so just be mindful of that but everything went smooth i can honestly say that um even though my <laughs> training was long as hell it turned out in my favor, I can say. So I, I got no complaints with the company so far. Uh, like I said, Tennessee Terminal, pretty disorganized. Um, I will be uploading a video about like how they pay us. Just so y'all know, just going in, if y'all decide to come with this company or not. But um, that video is definitely coming. Alright, y'all. So with that being said... This is just a quick rundown of what y'all need to expect. Uh, if y'all got any questions, holler at me. Give me a uh, shout out. 
Put it in the comments. Let me know something. I'll definitely get back to you, all right? Love y'all. Peace.